Welcome everybody, and well, and um, it's my next lesson on how you two can learn to play the music of ancient Greece in your spare room. Um, the lyre I'm playing is a replica of the ancient Hebrew Kinor, the lyre of the ancient Hebrews played by my very own, very ancient Levite ancestors, in the Temple of Jerusalem to accompany the singing of the Levitical Choir. For all details on how you can buy one of these amazing lyres, which are made by a company called Mid-East Ethnic Instruments, Please visit my official website, which is www.ancientlyre.com. Check it out. Um, anyway, this piece I'm going to show you is a fragment of ancient Greek music simply catalogued as Anonymi Bellum 97. Um, it was preserved, I believe, um, on, a, on um, an ancient Byzantine manuscript. The date of the thing um, could be anywhere between about 200 BCE to about, I don't know, about 100 AD or something. I'm not entirely sure, but it's an incredibly haunting melody. Um, so it can be found, and by quite frankly fantastic, recently released third album of um, mystical ancient lyre music called An Ancient Lyre, Echoes of the Ancient World. The concept of this album is like a musical adventure in time travel, starting off with the oldest piece of music so far discovered in history from ancient Mesopotamia. I can't say that word, Mesopotamia. The um, Hurrian Hymn from what is now Syria was found in Ugarit, and that dates from 1400 BC, before the time of Tutankhamun, in fact. Um, I do a, um, an improvisation on an ancient Egyptian minor pentatonic scale, as well as examples of traditional ancient, well, traditional Egyptian melodies on the lyre. Then we move on to ancient Greece. Besides this piece, which is um, track 11, I do the Song of Sikolos, um, unique, it's the only complete piece of music we have from the ancient world. That's from about 200 BC. Um, we've got the first Delphic hymn to Apollo, um, from 138 BC approximately. And Hymn to the Muse from the 2nd century by Mesomedes of Crete. Check it out, it's cool. Sweetiebaby.com. That's the plug out of the way with. Anyway, back to the melody. And um, the notes on this line, there's ten strings, um, are tuned. You've got at the bottom your D, then we've got E, F sharp, G, A, B, C sharp, D, E, F sharp at the top. To make it easier, I'm going to um, give each string num um, each string a number, just like guitar tab when I'm showing you the notes of the melody. Without further ado, here's the first half. We're starting off with um, string 1, which is D, then it goes up a fourth to G, which is in fact string 4. String um, string 6 is B, so up a, up a major third, up another third to D, which is string 8. String 7, C sharp. Then we have B, string 6, down 1 to A, string 5, G is string 4. Up one to A, string five, and um, string six is B, A is string five, back to E, string two, F sharp, two F sharps, in fact, string three, up a semitone to G, string four, up a tone to A, string five, back down to G, then down a fourth to your D, string one, up an octave to the um, next D is string 8, and then B. That repeats. I'll play it through without the benefit of my dodgy scouse accent so you get the gist of the tune. Beautiful melody. The second part of the tune is a bit fiddly. Um, we're starting off with string 2. Then string 3 is F sharp, A, sorry, G, string 4, then A, string 5, down a 4th to your E, string 2, minor 3rd to G, which is string 4, F sharp, string 3, then up to A, string 5, down a 4th to your E, string 2, back up um, a 4th to A, string 5, 
F sharp is string 3, with a semitone to G string 4, minor third down, to string 2 your E, up a tone to F sharp string 3, A is string 5, string 4 is G, then the string 2 is your E, then we go up to string 4 your um, G, uh, sorry G, then we have, that's yeah, sorry, string 4 is G, then string 5 is A, F sharp string 2, back down to your E string 1, string 2 I mean, then string 5 is um, your A, G is string 4, and F sharp string 3. Fiddly that tune, it's hard to play it and say it at the same time. Uh, let's just show you what that sounds like again. So we have E, E, F sharp, G, A, E, G, G, sorry, F sharp, and A, then E, A, F sharp, G, E, F sharp and A, G, back down to E, G, A, string 2 is F sharp, so string 3 is F sharp, then string 2, E, string 5, A, G, and F sharp, and it goes back to the beginning, the first part of the tune I showed you. Well, since it's a fragment, I have to do some improvisation here. The music of ancient Greece. Check it out. Um, please visit my website www.ancientwire.com. Bye for now.